Isaiah Thomas throws major shade at LeBron James. Hello and welcome to The Fumble here in Los Angeles. I'm Crystal Rich. Don't miss a play during the NBA Finals. Make sure you click the subscribe button below to join our notification squad. And you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Crystal Rich. At one point, LeBron James was really rooting for Isaiah Thomas to get back and better in the game when IT was with the Cavs. When IT was injured, LeBron said he even played NBA 2K just to see how Isaiah Thomas would fit into the lineup. I remember James wrote something on his Insta story a while back that we believe was about Isaiah. It said, when you become lazy, it's disrespectful to those who believe in you. That was back in January, and the next month, the Cavs traded IT to the Lakers. There was rumored to be a little bit of tension between Isaiah Thomas and James. And now, IT took the opportunity on national television to shade LeBron on Jimmy Kimmel Live. He was playing against the Pistons Hall of Famer, who he was named after, Isaiah Thomas. The game was called Generation Gap NBA edition and here's what IT had to say after scoring no points against his elder. I'm like the Cavs, I'm gonna get swept. <laughs> Shade, 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 shade. IT, you're just gonna go and shade LeBron like that on national TV? But in all seriousness, what if the Cavs never traded IT in exchange for Jordan Clarkson and Larry Nance? Would the Cavs be in a better position if Isaiah Thomas was still there? I mean, LeBron is pretty much the point guard for the Cavs, so maybe they could be in a better position. I mean, in IT's debut with the Lakers, he did put up 22 points off the bench. Maybe, just maybe, he was trying to prove that he isn't lazy. Now to the Cavs. Do you really think they are going to get swept? We did doubt LeBron throughout the entire playoffs, and he is back in the finals. But can he beat the Dubs? Although I'd love to see a seven-game series, I highly doubt that the Warriors would get a sweep. When LeBron's pride is on the line, he'll probably have another 50-point game. But let's just hope and pray there are no more J.R. Smith mistakes. Would the Cavs be in a better spot with IT? And do you think they'll get swept? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching The Fumble. I'm Crystal Rich.